everybody, Lori, of course, from Lori Book Trials, if you're new here, hi! And I got a new box to my channel. I got Shelf Lover, Shelf Lover, or Shelf Lover. That's what the looks like. I'm not going to show you the other side because it has the tag, but yeah. I think the theme was Warrior Women or something like that. Ooh, pretty, I like this. And this one is, yeah, yeah, Warrior Women, February spoilers. We don't want to look at spoilers. But we got this box. If I can get it open, because my hands are like sucking in it. You cute. We got these real cute earrings, I'll show you. But they will stay. They got like arrows, I think, different things on them. Let me see if I can put it on there. I know I don't have very good lighting in here. But, yeah, they don't want to, my thing don't want to show up on the, let me see if I can do it this way better. That's a little bit better. You see it now, you guys? There we go. There we go. That's what it looks like. So we got these earrings. It doesn't say who they're, if it's just from Shelf Love. I'm not sure. Let me see real quick if I can turn this volume thing off for you guys not hearing this. Oh, but it ain't gonna let me. Oh, well. Sorry, you guys, if you hear any ding-ding in the background. Okay. I've got some socks. Ooh. Neat. I'll show you what they look like. I like them because I like the, um, I like the design. Let me see what it says. Be a knife. I don't know if they both say the same thing or different. Yeah, it just says be a knife. So that's what they look like. They are cute. I like those. Those are cool. I like those socks. It looks like we got a, uh, what you call it, bag? What are they called? <laughs> you know, book bag. Or whatever you want to call it. Which says, Breathe Fire. Ooh, I like that one. Breathe Fire. So we got a book, well, book bag. Not bad. There's still some other stuff in here before we get to the, um, there's more stuff before we get to the book. Oh, look at this. Oh, wow. This is pretty um, print or whatever you want to call it. That's really pretty. Look at that. I'll let you know what everything is after we're done. Ooh. Ooh, look at these. These are neat. They must be the chest. So they said that each month you're going to get a couple of um, things that you can play chess. Ooh, neat. Look at that cute. Look what they're like. And then they go into the stand. Oh, that is cute. I like that. I think those are one of the special things. Like, like if you get the book only, there's like a thing. I mean, you get a couple of little things with it. We've got this bookmark. It says, why be the sheep when you can be the wolf? Ooh, cool. I just got this series, Grave Mercy. So now I got to... Now I got a bookmark for when I start it this month or next month. Each scale marks me as a survivor, a warrior of the wild. Cool. Look at this in the map. You guys know me with maps. These are really cute. And then we got one more thing before we get to the book. And that is the map that they were talking about. It says the wild on it. You know me. Maps are my thing. That is really cute. Probably we already know what the book is because they told us. They tell you each month what the book is because they had a um, thing on their website. I mean, like on their, you know, on their stories asking you if you want to know what the books are each month. But look. Isn't that pretty? Well, I'll take it out. 
not too bad of a first box for me. Ooh, ooh, I forgot. I almost forgot to show you guys the bookmark. You know, you guys should probably saw it. Just the bookmark, just like the, you know, just like the cover picture. I like that. I guess you can use it. It's for the wild one. Yeah, I like this. Ooh, ooh! I gotta show you guys this in a minute. Look at this. Oh, I love that. Okay, now I'll show you. We'll take this off for a minute. Look at this. Look at this. I'm like, isn't that neat? But that is so pretty. I love that. I think this is a really good first box. Because, you know, like I said, I've never got a box from them before. And I really love that. It's so, so pretty. I love when you get like something under, you know, like a po like a picture or poster, or whatever you want to say it is. It says, "Ooh, it's signed." It says, "Welcome to the wild." I love when you get books that are signed by the author. And I like when they say something like that, and they just don't sign it; they actually say something. Like that is neat. Part one: the trial. Huh. Okay, cool. So it has like part two. There's like, I'll tell you how many parts. There's like part four parts. Yep. So there's four parts, and there's 300 and. 29 pages, so it's not that big of a book. It shouldn't take that long to read. It says, How do you kill a god? Ooh. It says, As her father's chosen heir, 18 year old Razamer, something like that, Razamera, 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 has trained her whole life to become a warrior and lead her village. But when her coming of age trial is sab sabotaged, sabotaged, yeah, and she fails the test, her father banishes her to the monster-filled wildness with an impossible quest. To win back her honor, she must kill the oppressive, oppressive god who claims tribute from the village each year or die trying. You know, I didn't even know what it was about because I didn't want to go into knowing. I knew what the book was going to be, but I didn't know like what it contained, so I'm glad I didn't know. Gods and things like that. It says, I must have dozed at some point because consciousness suddenly jolts through me. My eyes are still closed, but heat pelts into my face from the sun. No, not the sun. The sun doesn't smell of blood and rot. I hold po perfectly still except for my hands, which search my lab for my axe. Bless, bless the goddess is still here. I crack open one eye. An unhinged zoning? Mouth is inches from my face, taste in my breath. A tongue lolls out and touches my chin. It crackles so loud it hurts my ears, unleashes from its mouth. Fear floods through all my limbs. I realize that even if I didn't have any answers, even if I don't know where to go or what to do, I now know one thing. I don't want to die. My instincts kick in and quick as I can. I raise my axe and press the shaft. Between those gasping jaws. Ooh. Says, praise for the warrior. Praise for the warrior of the wild. One of my favorite young people ever. The action, the world building, the voice. The, this book kicks so much ass. <laughs> Kel Dyrick, author of The Love Interest. Never heard of that one. But yeah, looks like it's going to be really nice and beautiful. I just love the cover. Hold on a minute, you guys. I'm so sorry this is loud today. I forgot to turn my volume off. Usually I have my usually I have my volume off, but I didn't think about it before I did the video. But yeah, I love this. It says, Welcome to the Wild. Very pretty book. I'm so excited to read this. 
I like both of these. I don't know which one to use because this one says a survive a survival of the wild. So I think I'm gonna use this one probably. I love that. Maybe I'll use both of the bookmarks. <laughs> okay, let's read what it says. Okay, so you get the letter in this. I never got them before, so I didn't know where the leather would be from the author. It says, Warrior Woman. Okay. The Anklet Socks, which I really love, and it's from a series I really love, and I want to reread pretty soon, and I darken. So these socks are and I darken socks, anklet socks. Let's see. It says, Tracy chose the quote specifically for these socks for our subscribers inspired by author Kristen White's signature for her and I darken series Trisha also specifically requested anklet sock for comfort on the go yeah. so yeah sky in the deep inspired tote bag I did read sky in the deep that's what that is sky in the deep which I love sky in the deep I need to do a reread of that one day it says, setting off on an epic journey, you'll need a style bag, a styling bag to keep all of your weapons and supplies in. Lettering by at KDP Letters. It says, Hunger Games inspired earrings. I do with those earrings. So that's what these are from Hunger Games, which... I'm doing a reread. I've only read the first one, so I'm going to start to reread. But that's what those are. Which I love because they're Hunger Games, and I really enjoyed the first book, which I'm going to reread and actually annotate this time. Let's see. This one says, We all agree the girl on fire has been represented in this box. You can wear her weapon of choice each day with these adorable wooden earrings. Okay, mass women, women inspired canvas print. Okay, there's your mass. Okay, it says, this was a collaboration of love between Dana, Trisha, and at ARZZ8. One of Trisha's fandom to name was Sarah J. Mass herself. But how can you choose just one of one of her series? We bring you the fairest warrior women of both Throne of Glass and A Court of Throne of Roses in one beautiful piece. We recommend hanging these prints with a poster hanging kit. See our website for a link to purchase one of your own. Really cute. I love this. I like Throne of Glass series better than I do um, the other one. You know, uh, Corn Throne of Roses. Yeah, I'm more of a thorn of roses. Trash. <laughs> okay. Warrior of the Wild and Grave Mercy inspired double-sided wooded bookmark, which I showed you, but it's in my book, so I'm not getting it out again. It says, Trisha and Lauren from At In The Reads collaborated to bring you the double-sided bookmark featuring a favorite quote from Grave Mercy, as well as a map and quote from our Book of the Month, Warrior of the Wild. Book of the Month, Shelf Love, exclusive signed edition of War Warrior of the Wild. It says, get ready for gods, monsters, and of course, Vikings in the Warrior of the Wild by Tra Tracy Livenseller. This is a story of friendship and courage. We were so honored not only to include the exclusive edition in our box, but to work with Tracy herself to curate these amazing, these amazing goodies. You enjoyed this gorgeous exclusive poster art on the reverse and dust jacket by at Morgan O. Anagram. Some of that. In this signed edition and Tracy's author letter. Bonus Alos. Alos? How do you say your name? And written chess piece. Piece 7 and 8 of our Saints and Sinners Collector Characters chess piece set. Collect all 32 in, in 2019 for the full illustration by at Silken Tara. Tara. 
cover and bookmark theme by at Kate underscore Adadar, Adar, something like that. So, yeah. It says, wear your woman, and it shows, you know, like, when their photo, I mean, photo thing is. It's like a shot, a shelf love green spotlight. Um, if you enjoy Warrior of the Wild, then check out Unrooted, Up <laughs> Nomi Novak, Sky in the Deep by Andrea Young, The Last Name Sarah by Christina Cicerelli, something like that, and The Girl of Fire and Thorns by Ray Carson. And then on the back it says, March's theme is Take Back the Throne. It says, Would you fight for your right to rule? Our March Take Back the Throne box features characters whose epic journey ultimately leads to their rightful place rule in the kingdom, their kingdom. Some will secede, others will not. Fandoms include Game of Thrones, <laughs> The Lunar Chronicles, Three Dark Crowns, and The Cruel Prince. Sorry, my nose is a little... I got a little. <laughs> then it says, um, after receiving overwhelming feedback with preferences for the book to reveal each month, we will be announcing the title moving forward. Our March book of the month will be Bloodleaf by Crystal Smith. It is an epic fantasy with a mysterious, I mean, mystery at its core. Core. See if I can talk. A young princess with a gift for magic is destined for an unhappy marriage when events force her into hiding. Now she must choose whether or not to fight to reclaim her kingdom in her family's name or rename or remain hidden to save her own life. It says we are also thrilled to announce that we have collaborated with our monthly theme artist Kate Adar and Adara, something like that, to create a gorgeous exclusive Game of Thrones mug with one of the series all time favorite characters for this box. Her thirteen mug shown right there is still one of our absolute favorites which this ain't the one we're getting but that's the mug that they were talking about that's one of their favorites so that's it what was your favorite thing in the box um mine is probably the socks and the earrings i love the earrings i love the earrings the earrings are beautiful and i love these chest little things so of course these are from Daughter of the Pirate King <laughs> I'm trying to see if I can get it open for you guys for I can put it on this little stand but it doesn't want to open with my fingers my fingers are saying no we don't want you to open it right now so my fingers are saying but we're getting it yay Said that there's something on it that you have to take off for it to stand. Oh, I think. Oh, okay. No, I'm not sure what it is. I know there was something they said you have to take. It's a little cracked. It's only a bad thing. Look, it got a little damaged. I don't know if you can see it, but it got damaged a little bit there. Just sad, but what can you do, right? Things happen. I know there is something they said you needed to take off of it to make it stand. I'll figure it out. I think it's like a coating. Oh, I see. I see what it is. Boop. It doesn't want to go off my finger, but I got it. Nope, she ain't going to stay on. And she's broke a little, which is kind of sad. Yeah, I don't want to go on there for me. There, nope. She keeps sliding. She don't want to stay. I was trying to get her on <laughs> display for you guys, but she's not having it. Yep, she don't want to stand. Unless I'm doing something wrong here. She just does not want to stand. She's saying, no, no, I don't want 
to show off for people. No, no. I don't want to show off for people. Let's see. Oh, no, she'll stay. Yeah, see, she don't want to stay on the on the chest thing. There. I guess that's the best you can do. I don't think you guys can see her, can you? Yeah, she don't want to stay on her little... Maybe I can figure it out later, but she don't want to stand on her little, her little thingy there. She's not having nothing to do with it. Yeah, she ain't. She does not want to go on there, you guys. Like, she's, she's stubborn. Or I'm doing something wrong. I took the plastic off, like they said, to do. Maybe you're just supposed to stand her part way like that. But there she is. Maybe that's what you're supposed to do. I don't have any idea, but she's cute, isn't she? But what is your guys' favorite thing? What, um, I love the map, of course. Because you know me, I'm a map person. But Ridden, I like Ridden or Ridden, however you say his name. It's like one of my favorite characters so far. I'm, I just started reading the book. So, but he's my favorite. I don't know, like I'm starting to like her, but I'm not sure, like if I like her as much as I like him. I like his, um, there's something about him that's kind of mysterious. Ridden or Ridden, however you say his name. I think it's Ridden. That just makes me more like him. But yeah, she's really cute. I wish you guys could see her when she's actually standing up. But she keeps sliding off. Let me double check. But yeah, I got a little little scratched on one on this part. Well, that's supposed to look like that, but I doubt it. Let's check him out real quick. Maybe he'll stand for us. Maybe I'm just doing it wrong. <laughs> I'm trying to get him to stand. Let me see if he's cracked anywhere. Mm, I don't know if it's really cracked or if it just looks sweet a little. But he don't look as bad as she did. Like, she was really, like, scratched up. He ain't that scratched, which is a good thing. Let's see if we can get... Him to stand, since I can't get her to stand. There we go. See, he's standing. There he goes. But yeah, I got him to stand. Woohoo! He's a cutie. Oh, he fell off now, though. I got him to stand for a minute. You guys are like, why are you guys, why are you still on showing me this? There goes my phone again. Does not want to stay, but anyways, you guys can't see that, anyways. <laughs> All right, so just let me know, like I said, what was your favorite thing down in the comments? Like I said, mine is the earrings. I like these chest things, besides, I wish it wasn't scratch like the girl was, but I can handle it. I'm really excited about the book, I'm really excited for this month's theme. To get the cup for, I'm um, actually going to give the cup to my hubby as long as it's, you know, looks like it's a, you know, like it's unisex. If it looks unisex, I'm going to give it to my husband. It's something that he, that I think, you know, I'm going to let him see it and then he'll let me know if he wants it or not. But yeah, he's staying pretty good compared to her. So, he's cute. I like him a lot. He's like, move me, move me. Let's see one more time if we can get her to stand before I close out. See, she's her, um, I don't know if it's her thing. Because she stands for a couple seconds. She falls a lot quicker than he does, but I think that's, it's better than it was, so. But let me know if you guys ever read uh, Pirate of the, you know, Pirate of the, Pirate, Daughter of the Pirate King, or if you read, and if you finished it up with Daughter of the Siren Queen. And let me know if you are getting any boxes in March and what the boxes are. 
I love you guys all. Um, whenever I get my fake crate, I'll be back with a fake crate unboxing. I think they're they said they'll have it shipped out by the 9th at the latest. So, hope <laughs> they will because, you know, but things happen. I know weather happens and stuff, and that's why. But let's quit talking about fake crate because this is shelf love. But, yeah, I'm really happy with my first box. Like, Socks are very useful. Rings. Uh, earrings. I got my ears pierced. Cute. And I like these chest stains, even though I didn't get January and February. I mean, January. Whatever. But, yeah. But I think there's a way you can... I don't know if you can add it on. There might be an add-on. But, I don't know. But, anyways, I'm going to wrap this, guy, this baby up. And like I said, I will talk to you guys all later. Remember, if you like this video, thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please think about subscribing to the channel. You will see a lot of unboxings like this. And yeah, if you do subscribe, remember to hit the bell so you'll know whenever a video of mine is being or is uploaded. Map, 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 map. Bye for now. Lurry out.